Is that I don't care about the environment. <laughs> Has the nicest people. You guys are the nicest people I've ever met. <laughs> I realized. <laughs> Maybe not this crowd. Uh, <laughs> dating sucks. Anybody dating? Anybody? <laughs> <laughs> yes? Is that a yes? Is that a butte yes? Uh, <laughs> Yeah, it's weird how thin that line is uh, between those two things. Uh, and that line is rope. <laughs> or latex, or duct tape, whatever you're into. It's not, it's not my fault. Lewis has a whole aisle for this shit. I didn't come up with it. That was excellent. <laughs> Redeemers, ladies and gentlemen. This comedian is going to get you too. Very funny lady. Make it nice and loud for Olivia Witt. Hello, yes, thank you. Anyone else? Yeah, you can go. Belden to Los Islands. I don't know. You're like, dude's baby making town. <laughs> I'm gonna birth 25 grass fed bulls. Can we do a palate cleanser for you? Can we do one for the fellas? Okay. I'll do one for the fellas, my fellas. <laughs> fellas. Don't you just hate when you're dating a chick? And she's crazy? <laughs> I mean, who cares if she's bipolar as long as she's bipolar? Am I right? Oh my god. <laughs> Thank you guys so much. My name's Olivia. Was it that bad? <laughs> you scared the shit. And I was like, you can do whatever jokes you want, but I don't know if you saw that statue of the Virgin Mary. <laughs> <laughs> Clap again for Olivia Witt, ladies and gentlemen. Comes to us all the way from Texas. Very funny man. I want you to make it nice and loud for C. H. Lee. Hello. Uh, if you don't like my jokes, uh, you can still enjoy my facial expressions. <laughs> Now, you don't have to be a nerd like me to be bad at dating, but it helps. <laughs> Do you know what is the most difficult part of walking up to a girl and asking for her phone number? The walking. <laughs> I think maybe I would have the chance if there was some way to approach girls by lying down. <laughs> I could say pick up lines like, 
You've taken my breath away. I'm already in this CPR position. <laughs> like, I have lost my way. <laughs> you know, marriage is some kind of fairy tale. Everything is happily ever after. Like, after I got married, I had to do a lot of dirty and disgusting things, like killing the cockroaches, cleaning the toilet, double dates, <laughs> talking to human. <laughs> you know, I really miss the day back when I was single. You know, for dinner, I could have like a whole rotisserie chicken <laughs> over the kitchen sink. <laughs> It is very convenient, you don't have to wash any dishes, and you can also wash your hands with your tears. <laughs> when my wife and I first met, uh, <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, your next comedian, very funny. She absolutely tore the house down in Townsend, Montana earlier this week. I'm glad we get to have her here with you tonight. Uh, she comes to us all the way from Los Angeles. Make it nice and loud for Irina Boreina. Like, in the last 10 years, I was only able to find three. People <laughs> were calling me. I mean, to tell us the truth. Did you sleep with Hugh Hefner? And I'm like, uh, well, you know what? That's actually really hurtful. Because he never asked. <laughs> For years, I felt like I was the only bunny who wasn't invited to share the carrot. <laughs> And what? Yes, movie like this. Why am I doing this? Why am I doing this? That's so funny. Yeah, isn't it? Well, the casters are almost. I'm not Jonas. Jonas, like the brothers. Yeah, you heard of them. I'm the Jonas sister. You haven't heard of me. That's all right. Yeah, if you, if you don't know drugs, although I hear you do. <laughs> And gaining weight, which is all stuff I do normally, so I don't know if it's really working for me yet. We'll see. Jerry's still out. Uh, I'm a little gay. I don't know, like, am I really a queer person, or do I just want an excuse to have this haircut? You know? <laughs> you like like I, I like to watch movies. I watch a ton of movies. It's just some kind of weird about me. I don't know if you guys have ever met anyone like that. Just kind of cool. <laughs> Clap more for Emma Jonas, ladies and gentlemen. <laughs> View Montana, did you enjoy the Away show at the last Best Comedy Festival? <laughs> Last Best Comedy Club not only produces this festival, they've actually got a really sweet club in Bozeman where they've got comedy all the time. Uh, you should go check them out. Uh, if you liked this venue, you should come back to this venue one week from tonight. We've got Hunter Lloyd coming through. He's going to bring some robots. Uh, clap again for all the comedians that you saw. Tonight.